Hello my friends, this is Wolfgang with Tools for Ascension. In my gift to you today, um, I will show you how you can cool your body or heat up your body um, through a very simple breathing exercise uh, that pretty much anybody can do. It doesn't take much and it's very, very fast. <laughs> Even the old girlfriends uh, of my mom you know, uh, when they were coming together for their coffee um, knitting circle. Uh, when they had hot flashes, I showed them the breathing exercise and within, let's say, 30 seconds to a minute, they stopped sweating and went back to normal. So this stuff works. Um, so let me just explain, you know, how this works. So you probably heard, you know, that uh, there are two uh, forces, two energy forces, you know, uh, around our spine, the Ida and the Pingala, you know, in the Ascolab um, stuff. Uh, you know, these are those two snakes. These are energies uh, that are, you know, winding around uh, the spine. Uh, one is heating and one is cooling. Uh, one is feminine and one is masculine. The masculine one is heating, connected to the sun, connected to the right side of the body. And the feminine one, you know, is cooling, connected to the moon, connected to the left side of the body. <clears throat> so, uh, let's say if you want to heat your body, let's say after, you know, a, a big meal, or if you are cold and exhausted, uh, one of the easiest way is to just lay on your left side, if you can do so at home. And you probably noticed when you had a cold, uh, whatever, you know, let's say when your noses are stuffed up, most of them, and when you lay on, let's say, your left side, uh, then after some time, you know, you can start breathing your, your right side. The lower one stays stuffed, the upper one opens. And um, so this, uh, when this opens and you only breathe this nozzle, this is going to start heating you up. Of course, if you breathe strongly, it will heat stronger. Uh, when you hold, you know, the other one down, the left one down, it goes faster, right? And so let's just try this. Um, take a little temperature. You know, how do you feel right now? Do you feel, you know, just get an idea. And let's start breathing. So close your left nostril, close your eyes, and just, you know, just inhale all the way in and then all the way out at the pace that you can at least hear the air flowing through your nostril. I mean, go brisk. Mm <laughs> yeah, I'm getting flushed already. <laughs> I don't know whether it shows. But you should feel it for yourself. If you're not doing it right now, I mean, you're wasting your time. I mean, you know, this will only not do it because Wolfgang said so, you know, do it later on because it worked. You know, if you do it, you know how it works. And, um, well, right now, I don't know how many seconds I did. Uh, in the editing, I will show you how many seconds, you know, we were breathing. So you get an idea. And so let's um, do the cooling. <laughs> um, so again, uh, you know, notice, uh, you know, how your temperature is, you know, see how you feel in your body. Close your right nostril and start breathing and smiling. Mm -hmm. All the way in. All the way 
Yeah, I'm kind of getting a little crazy kind of a feeling. Yeah. This is quite warm in here, but I mean, I definitely feel kind of coldish in my skin. Mm -hmm. So this maybe have been an, a minute to just see how you feel. Mm -hmm. And now, so in, uh, if you're a traditional yogi, you know, you probably learned about, you know, the balancing, you know, there's some um, breathing that you can do to balance left and right brain half. And yeah, there is an easier way to just put your tongue up to the palate and start, uh, you know, sending earth love into the center of your brain and it's going to balance uh, both of it. Oh, so because we just messed around a little bit with heating and cooling, let's just balance it. So just put tongue to the top of the mouth of the roof. All right, that should do it. And now we ask your spirit guides to ground you nicely. We ask them to put a nice force field around us that, you know, um, repels negative energy, only lacks positive love and light in. Amen. Mm -hmm. Make sure that none of your good energy gets stolen by the vampire beings. Mm -hmm. Amen. Ask that we are completely grounded now. Amen. And all the subtle bodies aligned. Amen. One, two, three. Back to vacant day consciousness. Well, <laughs> I hope you're comfortable now. This is very, very handy, I, I can tell you. Uh, being able to manipulate this. Um, I mean, I wouldn't, you know, jump right away towards uh, uh, breathing uh, wet blankets dry in the winter. Uh, but uh, it definitely helps, you know. And if it gets really cold, uh, do some breath of fire. <laughs> and imagine inhaling red energy, especially into your root chakra, and that will get you going too. So, as always, if you get a kick out of this, uh, watch those other videos, you know, because you're going to get a kick out of that too. Uh, you probably also will be able uh, to work with me very well. And, well, subscribe, ring the bell, give me some thumbs up, so, you know, this kind of teaching spread more. Uh, people can use it and keep smiling like an idiot, or as if you were in love, I love you. Namaste.